Hi, this is James. Again, I'm an online marketer, as many of you who are following me on my channels, whether it's uh, on Rumble, on YouTube, on the various uh, video outlets that I'm on. But I'm getting ready to bring you an update as to a radio show that I've actually listened to for years. Um, the gentleman actually ended up getting fired. iHeartRadio fired many uh, DJs across the U.S., and this particular radio show is, has been one through the overnight. And uh, I, I really, I personally enjoyed the radio show. And just uh, everything that had, has happened in the last few months, his firing. And then he is getting ready to start again. So I'm going to bring you this. And um, just, just as a way of me trying to help broadcast about it. I'm not getting paid for this at all. I just I just really enjoyed his uh, radio show overnight because I uh, I do overnight work sometimes and I just like listening to to news and, and radio. So we're gonna go to the go to the site and I talk about it and then we'll we'll uh, let you see what all is happening with him and we invite you to to follow him once his show starts up. So let's go ahead. And, all right, what happened to Steve Summers in America's Trucking Network, or ATN? Thousands of truck drivers are asking the same two questions. What happened to, to Steve Summers in America's Trucking Network? It was on December 6th. iHeartMedia fired hundreds across the country. Steve Summers was one of them. Since Steve is the voice behind America's Trucking Network, we can assume ATN is also gone. But starting in early January, Steve Summers will be starting a, a new show. Why was Steve Summers fired? Radio is a cutthroat business. Some say it was Steve's, uh, Steve's discussion of politics, but we'll never really know. Terrestrial radio as we know it is changing. Competition from podcast, online streaming, and the COVID situation has turned everything upside down in all forms of media. My, I'm, I'm going to do a side note here. My thing, personally, let me just go back to my screen here. Um, my, my personal thing is, I believe Steve had been at the radio station, and I'm not saying the radio station yet, but I, I've, I've already, I've already deleted iHeartRadio on my phone. I am not listening to the radio station he was on, and if you know of Steve Summers, you already know. Who, um, what radio station it was, but my my thing, I believe he was there for 23 years. Seniority means nothing anymore. So to me, let's vote with our listening. The radio stations and podcasts, everything go on the analytics of how many listeners. So boycott them. Don't listen. D delete the iHeartRadio app. There's other apps I've started to listen to. In fact, I. I you know, if you're interested, you can contact me uh, with the links around this this uh, video. But I'm just doing this just as a way of saying, you know, we can fight back. All right, let's get back to it. Um, what's next for Steve Summers? We can all be grateful that most companies aren't as cutthroat as the radio industry. Hot Shot Secrets has been behind Steve Summers for years and will continue to do so. He is, uh, what's happening? Introducing Overnight Drive Radio with Steve Summers. The new show will be Overdrive Night, Overnight Drive Radio with Steve Summers. Streaming live online, you will be able to catch a show via audio only or video. The show will also be available in podcast form. You can go to overdriveradio.com. Here we go. Here it is. In fact, it's on the uh, screen there. Overdriveradio.com. That's the website. And it's coming in January 2021. And, okay, now I will say it. The former 700 WLW America's Trucking Network host Steve Summers is returning to the airwaves with a new five-hour live stream talk show direct from the brand new Hot Shots Secret Studios. So I'm telling you, boycott. I'm telling you, boycott 700 WLW. Make them feel the pain. Um, one of my other... One of my other videos, I uh, one of their longtime sponsors has already done away with them. Make 700 WLW feel the pain. 
All right, you can go to uh, OvernightDriveRadio.com. You can listen to uh, Steve Summers getting let go, his start in radio, and then how Chris, uh, Chris is owner of a uh, Hotshot, um, and uh, you can listen to how they started. But it's Steve Summers, the Steve Summers Overnight Drive. That is live Hotshot Secret Studios. So that is what is coming. He's coming back to radio. Thank goodness. I am looking forward to uh, to listening to him. So you can also go to here Steve Summers' uh, um, Facebook page. Um, it's it's uh, facebook.com slash steve dot summers s o m m e r s dot five o three, um, and you can go uh, try to maybe try to uh, friend him. Not sure, um, but there you go. Um, so go to overnightdriveradio.com and follow Steve Summers. I want to thank you for listening to this video, watching this video. Um, if you have a business you'd like to me to refer, review, I'm a video online marketer. I, I pull keywords. I you know and I promote. Um, but I just want to bring you this, and I want to personally say, Steve Summers, I enjoy. I thoroughly enjoy your your radio show, the, your DJ capabilities, your um, just your your common sense conservative uh, political values, and uh, I, I, I just want to say thank you. I've enjoyed your show. I've never called your show, but I've enjoyed listening to you for, uh, for several years, and I wish you great luck and looking forward to listening to your new show. Thank you for watching, and we trust that you have a great day and a great 2021. We'll catch you on the next video.